turn seven. Very eager to fix my mistake here, so I'm just going to keep playing. Uh, is it just me or do those divisions look closer? <laughs> oh boy. Let's see what unexpected fuel use. They can't believe that they're sucking up that much fuel. What should we do? Um, and that's the truck guy. Let's do this. Avoid excessive maneuvering. Keep pushing, but keep it down. Um, okay. Uh, we didn't do too much. <laughs> Drunken Chief of Staff. Yes, you are tied with him. Oh boy, these are expensive. Give him time off. Reprimand him. I guess I'll pay the price. Ah. Great. It's one of the few roles that hasn't gone our way. Division Commendation. Let's do it. That's going to help with Von Rundstead. Uh, truck refit. Yes, we're going to do the refit. Oh boy, this is expensive. Um, rail conversion, Army Group North. So they're asking us, do you want to change it or keep going? Uh, I'm going to keep going down the line and we'll deal with those other things later. Um, hmm. Yeah, I kind of forgot to play my cards, didn't I? Protect my flanking. Yeah, it's Let's use this one. We definitely want to do encirclements with Heinz. Same thing with this guy. Hopner development. Okay. Uh, I feel like uh, I'm really playing. Okay. Now let's finish off Odessa. Please. Please let's finish off Odessa. Oh my gosh. What is it? It's It's got to be their entrenchment. It's... No, no it's zero. Maybe we'll get them next turn. I don't know. Maybe we send in the, um, the Romanians. You know? No. We're way over because... <sighs> Boy, those units are already damaged. I, I don't know. Do I wait one more turn? I really... Really expected to get it. It's after fighting. 32. Jeez. <laughs> hmm. You gotta say, that surprised me. Now let's get him on the right side of the border. Skiro. That's weird. I wonder if it's a new division. There's those Hungarians. Load rise division. Hmm, well, we've only got 3,000 
700 fuel. That's not very much. That's a pretty hefty mountain division. <laughs> wow. Uh, huh. That'll help. Beef it up a little bit. I don't know. Uh, interviews. Nicholas Chelan, past chief software officer of the uh, Air Force and Space Force. He's uh, been my guest a couple times. And uh, he's a uh, poop disturber. <laughs> he's definitely a rock the boat kind of guy, and that's my kind of guy. Uh, he's very interested in uh, achieving excellence and uh, competitive advantage for the United States and keeping it that way. Let's do that for now. And let's get my... Replacements from 4th Army in here. Oh, interesting. Alright. That's what you want. Oh, boy. <laughs> yeah, that's good. I'll link to that in the description below. Um, I had a really good talk recently about U.S. national security and competitiveness. And uh, if you think TikTok is a good thing, think again. It is uh, definitely a communist Chinese tool. Um, a lot of people use it, and they're not really aware of just how... Um, I don't know what, whoops, that was a mistake. I didn't want to move him there. Um, just how insidious, there's the word that I want, that uh, that app is. You know, people go on there. All right, time to take some advice, I guess. And The readiness looked fine. Maybe not there, but... <laughs> Not fantastic, I guess, huh? Huh. Their guys are all tired. Um, where are you? Okay. Nope. I can't. Can't move that. 60 second to there is what I wanted to do, but... Not without getting my headquarters into the swamp. Technically, I could move 6th Army Headquarters there. No, no, it's not going to work. Of course, they say it's fine. That, that hex is fine, but I don't believe it. I want some coverage <laughs> for that headquarters. All right, I want to feel like I have a strategy here. Um... I guess we'll get these guys across the river and I want to surround Skiro. That's nah, too far away. I really wonder what would happen if I assaulted this with the um The Romanians. I mean, we'd have that horrible bonus against us, uh, I guess, a penalty of uh, a negative bonus, yeah, uh, of going after something that's a hundred and something. No, I'll wait till next turn. I'll wait. Why is it down here? Yeah, it's crap until that. Um, that bridge is fixed. I 
I'm going to advance because what's the point in not advancing? <laughs> right. uh, I think that's fine. Hmm. It really is a question of where to apply the force. A lot of me wants to grab this. I try and do that, but they're so amorphous. This will take care of itself in a turn or two. I'm not too concerned about that, except for the fact that it's massively slowing down our uh, supply chain, right? We want to be able to make that move to Prescuro with the forward supply base as soon as possible. No, that's it. Okay. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. I don't like any of this. <laughs> I was thinking about driving up here and cutting these guys off, but it's only I'd only trap like four divisions or something like that. I've already got three right here. Uh, what is that? That's pretty big. Maybe I should try and grab that. How much is this? 119. Three to two hundred. I wonder if I can get one more. So I wanted what I wanted was two hexes that I could beat on this hex with and try and get a breakthrough. here is really a setup for next turn 
Not this turn. We're out of fuel. Which is annoying. Let's see if I can get the Luftwaffe to resupply us. I doubt it. I really doubt it. Yep, it's just too darn far. Okay. And I'm worried about these units. <laughs> Yeah, we got a we got a little bit of a problem now. Oh boy. Hmm. It looks like I'm gonna have to bite the bullet and move my forward supply base because. This ain't good. Um, I really am extended here. Uh, I'm going to make a retreat adjustment for that guy. The rest of them should be okay because they're doubled up. <laughs> it's not great. It's really not great. Hmm. That at least joins us up and gets us a good supply line, although we still don't have that one hex. We need that hex right there to complete the rail line coming along. Oh, there's a reminder on my phone for me to play this game now <laughs> at this time. Well, that's good. Uh, I'm a little depressed about that. I, I can't. Ugh. Really sucks. Here we've still got fuel. Okay. That's good. Now we're all. Back in, in the line again. Now our goal is Orsha. That was a bit of overkill, but it didn't hurt me, so good. behind here I guess I can it's a little out in the open right but I think I'll have blocking units here um, let's see here 46 on the 187 let's give it a shot okay Orsha is ours why <laughs> why I'm going to double up. I have to. Um, can I get you to... Yep, I can. Okay. Well, you're going to go there. Okay. 
What's going on? The readiness is fine, but their movement is not good. Look at that. That's terrible. Able to move like one hex. What's going on here? All right, just stay there. <laughs> Don't do anything. Uh, yeah, I'll move up. Okay. Uh, huh. All right, I want this bridge. That's perfectly acceptable. That is tempting. That's it? I guess it came from somewhere else. Uh, okay. Can we attack? Very, very even tank on tank battle. I don't know. Mogolith. This, of course, isn't good. Yeah, I'm not going to risk it. Interesting. Who would I move over there? I guess Des Reich could go there. It's strong enough. <clears throat> okay. Alright, I don't want to move the headquarters anymore. Oh, well, this is kind of ugly. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, it's acceptable. All right. that unit and run you up there it's pretty good well, at least the south side of the river will be ours all right, nothing to write home about, really, but I'll take it. At least we have Orsha. We won't be able to move the supply line till next turn, though. And then I've got to think about who I want to rest. Mm -hmm. Like this giant hole <laughs> right here in the Pripyat. It's only two hexes, but it's enough if they come pouring in. All right, I don't think I need to do anything with the fins. Let's finish these guys off.
That's what I should have done last turn. <clears throat> you know, surrounded them fully, taken away their supplies, and wiped them out. Okay. Hmm. How are we doing for fatigue with these guys? Where's my report? 93%, 12%. Yeah, it's not a lot, but they certainly could do it with some resting. What about you? 3%. Okay. army all squared away. Let's go there. They can. Okay. I want them to take Ostrov. Do it. Yeah. Um. Okay. I'm going to move them there for this turn. I don't want them there. I want them on this side, but for the moment. Um, is there another? Okay. Oh my goodness, what is going on? The movement's so low <laughs> for these guys. Um. Hmm. Feels like one of those sloppy, haphazard things, and I'm not happy with it. Okay. That's as far as you can go. That's as far as you can go. Gets these guys freed out of there. You see, I really would like another unit up here. Um, it's not going to happen right now, but well, maybe. Okay. Hmm. For the moment. That really is a drag though. I can move two more. <clears throat> All I'm doing is doubling up to make sure that nothing bad happens. So I want to break through here. Hmm. I have a feeling I have to wait. <laughs> like, it's just not gonna work out right. I think I might rest the 18th. <clears throat> I think that might be a smart move. They're not super tired, but some of them are. 12%. Yeah, it's not a lot, but 
I don't know. I think they could run through and take the rest, you know, but I'd have to sit there for two turns. Are we going to accomplish anything? What are we going to accomplish? I could go after these guys. Do I want to? I want that guy out of there ASAP. This situation has changed quite a bit. I mean, we, we've pushed them, and I think we've pushed them as far as we can to a couple of these points, right? Like here. This is kind of an unexpected and weird blocking point. Jeez. What do we got here? 500? Okay, so they could... Uh, I'm going to put these guys on 25%. These guys will stay... Can't even do it. If I could back both these guys off to Orsha, I would. It's not terrible, but... Hmm. We're starting to see our, our supply problems, though, right? We don't have enough fuel to do what I want to do. <clears throat> even when we have the action points to do it. Can't believe that Odessa <laughs> didn't get taken. Uh, and I'm sure a lot of that has to do with the supply situation over there. Nobody can attack. Okay. This is because of that no fuel thing, right? <laughs> All right. I, I, you know, these guys just aren't tired enough to me. Um, I want to get them out here. I think they can help take this peninsula or get over here to Peskov uh, before I rest them. I think they can. And I really want that supply base to be here. Technically, we, you know, if we'd change the rail, we could do this. But getting up in here, then I'm relying on Narva. I don't know. I might, I might change my plan. We'll see. I don't plan to yet, but you never know. All right, let's look at our last things. Airfield. Well, it would help. The question is, like, we're going to get the chance to switch it to Ostrov next. Fort Supply Base Army Group North. There's no point in moving anything because our bridge is still broken. Army group center. <clears throat> We're going to wait till next turn and see what comes up. Army group south. It'll take two turns and I just, I would rather have Prescaro. And I think it did everything. Shocking. <laughs> so really, I'm interested in what they do in front of Ostrov. 
Okay, they're getting the heck out of there. Interesting. <clears throat> Looks like they're going to make a Narva stand. This is very surprising. Really. I don't know why they got out of there. It was a perfectly good, like, battle standpoint. <coughs> I see some stuff happening in the swamp. Uh-oh. Where is that? That's in the south. Okay. Yeah. And I think there was a... Ooh. That was interesting. It's, in, it, it's always striking to me how I come into these things with a pretty clear idea of what I want and where the units should move. And then as time goes on, um, it really starts to get muddy <laughs> fast. What is happening here? Where I, We're going to look at these battle reports and see what the heck just happened. Because they did three attacks and they hit us good in those spots. All right, let's save. And oh, the rain is back. Oh, boo. <laughs> right here is where it's the worst. Um, hmm. <clears throat> It looks like a candidate for encirclement, doesn't it? There's a lot going on down here. Well, in an area that I don't particularly care about, but it means that I'm stuck. Um, good. Yep, reinforcements. So, second army can come out at Minsk. Look at this! What is this? Yikes. Yikes. Okay. Um... <clears throat> Huh. Convoys. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff happening, yeah. So we can move to Orsha. I called it Ostrov, sorry. That was a mistake. Um, that's very good. It's still Lavov, because I haven't captured anything yet. Let's see. About the bridge rebuilding. So no, no, no bridges. Damn it. This one was pretty close. These were terrible. <laughs> oh. Okay. Excellent. Some Panzer failures. Great. Truck columns. Well, we'll switch that. That's the, every time I see the things at the bottom of these reports, I just think of a clown army, right? Oh boy. Insufficient truck columns. That's weird. All right. So, yeah, we got to make some changes. And we know that. Let's get that second army that I can plug into army group center there. Coming soon. Yo. Uh, what happened in army group south? Splat. Nothing. That's not good, and I don't have any air supply to get to them either. These guys are just not great. Not great. Um, the trains are still running. Clearly, we had a problem with the trucks in the south. I'm not quite sure why it's so bad, uh, particularly since I said to do the, um, the maintenance on there. <clears throat> Mm. 
So it went out on the trains. And it did not go out on the trucks. Not one truck. What is going on? Yeah. 233. Distance penalty. Okay. So I have to move. I have to move. Um, I have to take Prescuro and move. <sighs> okay. I'm a little freaked out. <laughs> We're going to go check out that interview with uh, Nicholas Chelan. Uh, actually, a couple of them. I'll link to them in the uh, description below. And uh, I will see you next time.